Craig here, up in our Egan, Minnesota Manufacturing and Distribution Center. I wanted to uh, talk to you today about a piece of equipment that we've had in the market for some time. Uh, but like, just bring your awareness to it. It's a simple ink removal system. It's an F-series. We make them, as you can see, in a 25 by 36 inch format, a 23 by 31, and also a 20 by 24. They can be set up to have two screens per unit, cleaned at a time, or we can do one. Um, it's all made out of polypropylene, which of course is chemically resistant. Um, a lot of people think that polypropylene is all, all glued together. It's not. It's actually welded, just like metal is, using a polypropylene uh, welding rod. So it has extreme durability. Um, this particular unit is set up with an air pump, um, which is advantageous in some situations, or with an electric pump, um, explosion-proof electric pump. Um, I particularly like the electric because in that case, we can do two screens up at a time. We have more flow, about 20 to 22 gallons per minute of fluid being passed through the unit. So it's not a high pressure cleaning for ink removal, but it acts, just floods it dramatically so that it just dissolves all of the, all of the ink. We have a um, simple lift top entrance and exit. It has a switch on it so that if the machine happened to be running, Somebody comes by, lifts up the hood, it's going to automatically shut it down, kind of thing. So let's take a closer look at some of the Inside, of machine. you will see that there are two fixed sprayers at the back of the booth that are flooding the bottom side of the screen. And then in the front, you have a rotating spinner. So that simply rotates under the pressure of the fluid and puts out a full spray which gets into all the corners of the screen as well as all of the edges and you've completely cleaned it from both sides of the screen. On the unit we're looking at here it has an air pump and that air pump takes the fluid from underneath pulls it through up and into a canister filter which is a big blue, and that then filters out any of the, the ink that's been dissolved down into the fluid prior to it going back into the spray heads that are going to be spraying onto the screen. So we're constantly reusing all of the fluid over and over and over again, which makes it extremely cost advantage. Now the other side is that instead of having this air pump, we can go into that electric pump that I mentioned before, and at that point, we can clean two screens up at a time. And I think that happens to be a big advantage, in my opinion. As far as cleaning is concerned, there's an access panel right below your blue pump. So we can get down into the chamber where all the fluid is and remove it, clean, and then start all over again. Eventually, you will have to replace the solvent. So you have easy access, simple machine, easy controls, on off switch. It's set for three minutes when you get it. However, you can adjust that so that it actually can be lengthened or shortened depending on how well you card the ink out of your screens prior to putting them into the unit. The other nice feature is on the other side. We have a container so that when you pull out your screen, you simply set it in that slot. It has weeping holes, so any chemical that's running off the, the uh, screen goes right back into the unit itself. Simple, easy, very operational machine. So this is the F-Series. We also have a T-Series where the traveling arm actually cleans the screens as it passes back and forth. Another application for larger screens or even this particular size. Different approach. Um, we also have a wide variety of inline cleaning systems and a lot of custom built models for individual customers so that you don't have to pick something up off the shelf. You can actually have something custom designed specifically to meet your needs. Thank you for watching. You know where to find us. 
Until the next time.